Hey everybody, this is Smart Ass Nick. Uh, I wanted to do a little video demo of the uh, Strymon uh, Deco pedal. And uh, I've just been playing around with it for about two weeks. And so I just want to kind of give my thoughts on it, I guess. Um, I want to mention right up front something that Tavo said in one of the guitar threads. Um, that the El Capistan is a tape echo simulator pedal. And this is a multi-tape head simulator pedal, so it's a little different. The, the Al Capistan is more like a Echoplex, and this is more like a tape machine. Uh, and inevitably when, you know, Les Paul was experimenting with multi-track recording, by putting the heads in different spots, he came up with chorusing and flanging and delay. And so that's what this pedal does. Um, there's two sides to the pedal. There's a tape saturation side, which has the tape saturation, the volume of the saturation, and then there's the tape head side, which gives you the distance of the tape heads and your warble effect. And then there's a blend knob. Uh, both sides can be used independently. So you can actually just use the tape saturation just to get gain if you're not using the delay part. Um, also, I want to mention that the learning curve on the El Capistan is a lot higher than the Deco. The Deco secondary functions are high, mid, and low EQ, and the auto flange sweep, uh, which I haven't even played with yet. So far, I've just been messing with the pedal with the factory settings, whereas the El Capistan, you really need to get into the uh, secondary functions to make the pedal what it is. So <clears throat> I may do another demo after I start playing with that, but um, I don't have a cameraman, so you just got to deal with it. I'll, I'll put a picture so you can see a little bit better, but... Pedals on. This is my clean sound. Just a little reverb on the amp. Um, and I'm just going to set up right now. I have it set up for a little longer delay. It's a, it's a cleaner saturation. down just a little bit and you can add in out I'm gonna add in the dino brain to show you that it still works with that Same thing, all I have to do is adjust the tape head distance. If I go up a little bit higher, I'll get a slap back. Same thing, I'll add the dino brain in. So, so you still get that good slapback sound out of it. I will back it down a little bit and show the chorusing effect. And we'll just increase the warble a little bit. So for the chorusing. Actually, I'm going to increase the saturation a little bit and go into a flanging setting. Dino Brain 
action with that tone. So you get flange in chorus, um, delay echo. I'm going to turn off the um, and I'm just going to play with the um, the, the uh, saturation side of the pedal. So I'm going to lower it down. There's the saturation lower. Okay. Now if I just, I'm going to back the volume of it off and kick the saturation up a little bit. You can see it's biting a little bit more. You can also see... That's the saturation from the pedal. I turn it off. I've been using it as a utility. Uh, sometimes I'll just bring my Corvette, my little Vox amp, and the Deco, and it's giving me, you know, saturation, distortion, echo, delay, chorus, and flanging. So it's great for practices when I want to travel light. So that's the basic pedal. Um, you know, thanks for listening. Talk to you later.